I've got this tracksuit on again because basically I need to wear it for a photo because then my feed will look consecutive and I haven't done my makeup and I look very red, I'm not sure why I'm not red. Um, because I am, oh dear, there's an ambulance. God, it's all kicking off. As soon as I start filming when I'm driving, it all kicks off. Um, yeah, I've not done my makeup because I'm filming a no makeup makeup tutorial today. But this morning I woke up so, well, I woke up at nine o'clock, but I didn't go to sleep until half past four because for some reason I just couldn't sleep last night and I don't know why, I just couldn't. So I've literally had like five hours sleep, less than five hours sleep. And I woke up to the sound of someone doing some kind of work in my house. Like, well, I know what they're doing, they're putting the new kitchen door on. But I thought, oh, it'll only take two minutes, it's fine, it'll be fine. Oh no, like, what time is it now? 12 o'clock, they're still there doing it. And I've not had a coffee yet. I've been up since nine, I've not had a coffee yet. And I've had, probably between four and five hours sleep that is just not okay so i quickly like just went over my hair in my bangs hey hi they look horrible when i've got no makeup on but it's fine with you um and yeah i quickly went over my hair and i was like i'm gonna have to go and get a coffee because i couldn't go into the kitchen whilst he was working so i'm literally driving to starbucks now I was gonna go to Costa, but I can't bother to get out of the car, and Starbucks is the only one with a drive through But Starbucks is so inconvenient because you have to go like down the bypass, and then I can't get back without going all the way up the bypass, around the roundabout, and coming all the way back again. So <laughs> it's inconvenient, but I am starving, and I desperately need a coffee. I didn't realise until this morning how addicted I was to coffee because. I've been up since nine, it's 20 past 12, and I'm literally about to kill someone. So, it's fine, breathe, it's all good. Um, we're going to get a coffee now. And maybe I might get a panini actually. Oh, I wonder if they've got the new um, vegan tuna sandwich, I might try that. Um, we're gonna go do that. And then maybe I'll feel okay. But my head is pounding. How bad is that? My head is pounding. I mean, I know that's probably got something to do with the fact that I've not slept properly. And I've had, like, just not enough sleep whatsoever. But the fact that I still haven't had coffee yet is still adding to that headache. So it's kind of like a tired headache and a no coffee headache and a very, very hungry headache. You just went for a red light, mate. Well done. Um, so, yeah. I'll spit. Oh, I might try that. Um, what's it called? The new brown sugar, blah blah blah. I really need a hot one now. Shall I get two? <laughs> Shall I get two coffees? God, I'm an adult. I can do what I want. Why do I think that's such like <gasps> two coffees? I can do whatever I want. Um, I'll see if they've got that one. I think it's an iced one though. I'm not sure. We'll see. Yeah, I really want to try that though. It sounds really, really nice. Apparently it's like um, the bubble tea, like the brown sugar bubble tea. I've never had that, but apparently it's incredible. And the coffee is very similar, so. I'm gonna go whilst this one is taking a bit. Um, but yeah, oh my God, I'm actually excited. What a cute, spontaneous little Starbucks date. Trying all the new things. Never say that again, Tony. Totally. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I caught for a little taste test. I think so. How exciting. So, I've got this tuna sandwich, which doesn't look great. I'm not a fan of the plastic packaging, to be honest. That doesn't make me want to eat it. Um, I don't know why. You know, it's been just like. So now, um, let me clean up here whilst I'm not moving. Oh shit. Yeah, can see a bit better. Um, then, this is the glorious brown sugar oat shaped espresso, which I'm guessing is basically just an iced latte, iced oat milk latte with brown sugar. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
much stronger than like an iced coffee but I guess it's because I always have iced latte very good though mm. let's just put tuna on the side tuna <laughs> let's try this tuna sandwich tuna this is vegan tuna I'm expecting good things Starbucks Good things. Looks good. It smells like a cheese sandwich. Mmm. It's different. It doesn't taste like a cheese sandwich, but it's good. The tuna, which is pea protein, red onion, vegan mayo. Horse radish, that's what's knocking me off. Cucumber and rocket. It's giving off the vibe of a tuna sandwich, but like a posh tuna sandwich. And I think it's the rocket and the horse radish. They're two quite strong flavours in it. And I'm not getting much tuna. To say that I'm not a massive fan of, like, I'm not a very big peppery person. I don't really like rocket. But that's really nice in that. I like it. It's not close to a tuna sandwich though. Don't know how I can get on with five pounds for a coffee lad, but you know. Desperate times called for desperate measures. Let me tell you that for free. Okay. Cheers to that. Let's go home and make some content. Also didn't introduce this fog properly, but hi. Hello. Um yeah. Enjoy the rest of it. Don't know what's coming up, don't know how long it's gonna be. Let's see. I should have been in Scotland, so I felt like this was going to be like a really, like, wholesome countryside on the lake vlog. But that's not going to according to plan, so here we are, Starbucks, where I live. And I'm trying to find the other one of this. I'm trying not to take them all off here every time I need one, but... I need two and I can't find another one. <laughs> By the way, my toilets are all like this because I've still not unpacked them from about a week ago. But it's fine. I thought I was going to be going away again and then I didn't. So they're all just like here like this. I found it. I found another one. This is the current state of my makeup bag. Not too bad, but not great. All my brushes are in here. It's cute, isn't it? I got this free when I spent over £20 at NYX. And it's so handy. Hi guys, little update for you. It's been a long time since I last filmed. But um still the same day, don't worry. Still got my track suit on. Shock. Um Mum's not been very well, so I've just been helping her out since I got back from whatever I was doing this morning. Getting a coffee. <laughs> um, finished my work for today. Currently, this is what my diary looks like. Just a big hot mess. Um, I've changed things around all week. I've, I always try to make a structured plan for myself on the Sunday before the following week. And then throughout the week, it just gets all discombobulated and switched up. Um... So tomorrow is a very busy day of content. I have got literally content coming out of my ears, which I'm so grateful for. Um, but lots to still do. And today it's just been a while because I've been helping my mum. And yeah, just catching up with her basically and helping her out because she's not very well. And I've just filmed some TikToks for a few brands. Literally about five different brands. So now it is quarter to seven. I've just had a tuna wrap. And I'm just going to sort out what I'm doing tomorrow, what I basically have. And then, um, I can't, honestly, I can't wait to sort this hair out tomorrow. Look at the state of it. I think this is like, I only have, I don't know what I'm saying, it's too late. It's too late. I can't, can't speak. But you know when like, I don't know how often you like, wash your hair, but I wash, I used to wash my hair every other day. And then I managed to keep it going for like, three days. And then I'd wash it. 
but because I've just had this fringe cut in, I feel like because I'm touching it constantly, it's going really greasy really quick. So I'm going to have to wash it tomorrow morning, but it's fine because I've got loads of content to get anyway. So it'll look all nice and fresh. Um, I'm going to shut on Amazon tonight and order some stuff because I have an idea for something. And I really want to do it. And I'm determined to do it. So I'm going to start like writing down what I need for that. And maybe ordering some stuff. Just to make my life a bit easier, it's not that exciting. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to sort myself out now. Get ready for bed. I know it's only a quarter to seven, but I like to put my jams on. Take my makeup off. And I've got to edit this reel from my no makeup makeup look from earlier. So, still got work to do. Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday. It's an absolutely glorious day and I'm going to go and get my nails done. Let's just get into some actual light so you can see me. I'm going to go get my nails done. It's a gorgeous day. It feels about 15 degrees, but it's not. It's like 7. Um, but still, it's lovely weather. Well, it looks like it's lovely weather. It's absolutely glorious sunshine. Am I blurry or is it just my window? Um, so yeah, I'm definitely need to get my nails done. I've literally got like one nail off on both hands and they're all lifting. I don't know why, I feel like no matter who I go to, no matter where I get my nails done, they are always lifting after like three weeks. Um, to be fair, I get my nails done like every three, three to four weeks anyway, but I just feel like I don't know, I feel like it's been a really short amount of time since I got them done, so a bit annoyed, but it's fine. I wanted to get some fresh nails anyway, I still have my Valentine's Day nails on. Um, and then, I don't know if it's going to be to Primark or not, I'm trying not to spend any money, but I kind of just want to see what they've got, and I also need some like, you know like just some odd bits that everybody needs kind of thing. Um, I don't know if to do that or not. I really need to do some exercise, but I don't want to go to the gym because it's like such a nice day. So I kind of like want to go for a big long walk, but I don't know. Anyway, I get my nails done, see where the day takes me. I've had a couple of days, like my mum's not been very well. So um, I've been like kind of looking after her a bit and not really getting any work done because I've kind of been distracted or like, I know I always feel weird like filming my videos and stuff in the house when everyone's there, so um, I've not really been doing any work apart from like, I've done a couple of YouTube videos and done some TikToks for the brands, but yeah, it's been a slow couple of days. So if I like Sunday, reset, get everything done so that you're ready for next week. I'm gonna like write down what I wanna do for like meals and stuff and my gym routines and yeah just kind of sort myself out for next week my camera is flashing great that's amazing um i'm nearly there anyway I literally just it takes me like not even five minutes to get to where i get my nails done um so i'm just gonna park up and yeah i'll take you with me as much as i can It's gonna be so annoying. I got my nails did. I went for something a bit more natural today. But for a nudie pink, actually a really nice colour. Didn't think it was gonna be that nice, but it was. Um I did dip into Primark and I was gonna show you what I got, but I didn't really get anything. I got some cotton pads because I needed some. And a dressing gown and some socks for my mum because she's going into hospital soon. Um so yeah, I didn't really get anything to show you properly. Um, now I'm going to go get my car washed and go to get some food shopping as well. My sister's asked me if I will <laughs> drive past her car and see if it's got a ticket on it because she parked it somewhere last night. Um, so yeah, why is that beeping? I'm going to go do all those things as well now. It's a really, really lovely day. Why is that? 
Are you kidding me? So I could have gone through this. I'm so confused. I'm gonna put it in anyway, just to say that I've left. The barrier's up, but there's like no car there. So I literally could have just not paid. Is that what you're telling me? But the barriers, but what? So the barrier was up, but there's no car there. So I've just paid for my parking for absolutely no reason because I could have just driven straight out. <laughs> That's so annoying. But I wanted to put the ticket in just so it'd know that I'd left. Do you know what I mean? Because what if I got like a fine or something? Because I've, I've paid, but what if they'd never knew that I left? You know what I mean? Um, I'm gonna go this way. So I've got the ticket anyway. <laughs> Is that really stupid? I want to go to this car because it's so convenient, but it pisses me off that they charge me eight pounds and I haven't got a large car. They charge me eight pounds for absolutely nothing and they do a shit job as well. So I kind of am um, not wanting to do that. Do you know what I mean? Eight pounds to get your car washed. I've got a small, well, I've got like a medium car. And most places charge me for a small car. So it annoys me that they charge me eight pounds, but it's so close to everything that I need to do all the time. But then I end up driving like really far away to go to a car wash that it's just completely unnecessary drive away. And it annoys me. Anyway, let's stop lying in. Go to Aldi, get some food. I'm starving. So this is always if I did go food shopping when you're hungry. Because then I end up buying like loads of unnecessary stuff, or I just end up buying loads of shit. And I'm determined to be happy this week. In fact, you know what I'm gonna do before I go into Aldi? I'm gonna write down on my notes my meal plans for this week healthy, good stuff, and write down a shopping list. And then I know that I won't pick up anything else because subconsciously I'll be like, eat healthy. Does that make sense? Is that really stupid? <laughs> Look at me, my hand, so I have my nails done. She really hurt, I had one and it had like, you know those like skin pulley things that are called willows? I know, I didn't know they were called that either, that's what told me. I had one of those and she kept like, put, like she was obviously doing my nails, but she kept pushing down on the little bruised thumbnail bit. It didn't even really hurt. Oh no, he's dropped his shoe and the man doesn't know! Oh no! Oh, I couldn't stop either because it's a really busy road. He dropped his shoe. He just, this guy just picked his kid up and his shoe came off. And he's not realised that the shoe's come off. And the mum's walking way, 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 way in front with the pram. So she's not noticed either. Oh my God. And they've not like walked up to me. It's like, oh, I can't stop and tell them. What a sad day that's going to be for them. I like that's going to be one of those things that just really annoys a parent. Because they're going to be like, when the hell did that come off? <laughs> and they're going to get really straight. Oh my god, look at the state of my hair. I've just finished at Aldi. Got some snacks because I'm starving. I've not eaten since this morning and it's like half two. Um, got this to try. High protein. Ooh cookie dough 21 grams of protein per bar it was expensive but i'm guessing it's like a meal replacement thing i'm obviously not going to use it as a meal replacement um but i got that cute there's loads of different flavors as well and then i got these which I've, I've actually tried before but in the pickled onion version i've got the roast beef veggie puffs i think they're meant to be like healthy monster ones essentially um yeah, I got them, they're cute. And then I got Diet Coke as well because I'm so thirsty. Oh no, I'm just having my nails done. I'm not going to be able to do this. Done it. Oh, so good. I always do this, but I'm really intrigued to try this actually. I'm going to try this first. I always do this, but there's a KFC right in front of Aldi. Oh, it's like a bar of chocolate bar. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, she just hit 
vegetable. Mmm! Caramel in it. Like a Mars bar. But not. Cookie dough. Mmm. Kind of. I can't work out which bit's making it difficult to, like, bite off. Or which bit is difficult to chew. Mm. It's weird. Oh, I can't work it out. I'm getting stuck in my teeth, but I don't know which part. It's very really difficult to bite and chew, but I don't know which part is making that difficult. Looks like a Mars bar, but doesn't texture wise, it isn't like a Mars bar. Really confused. I'm very stuck in my teeth. That's a lot of effort to eat that. <laughs> a lot of effort. I'm going to try it again. I really love the roast beef Monster Munch flavour. I think they're like great. Mmm. Not quite up there, but they're a good veggie, healthier alternative. Eight to seven calories in each bag. Not bad. It tastes like the same as the pickled onion ones, but obviously a different flavour. It tastes like baby crisps. Which I love. Also, who's noticed that I've managed to fix this situation? One was like really thin, one was really big. And everyone kept saying to me, are you sure that that one isn't like turned back? And I was like, no, no, it's definitely not. Like the whole thing is just like smaller. Anyway, it was just turned back. I'm all good. They are the same. I haven't been mugged off. Right. I'm gonna go because that is a lot of people here. Everyone's looking for a space and I'm just sat here like eating my snacks. I've made a lot of mess with that. Oh my god, I made such a mess. Wait, I want one more bite of the chocolate thing. Cookie dough thing. Mm. I like it. It's just not worth one pound a bar. Really stuck in my teeth. Like really bad. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Bye. Food haul. I got some seaweed sticks because I love beef. They're a really healthy, like low in fat snack. Kiwis, blueberries, some marmites. My mum told me I'm eating all hers. Cat food, oranges, cucumbers. One of these rice things. I've got loads of rice in the cupboard, but I wanted to try this quinoa one. And peppers, kale, some beans because they're really high in protein and great for veggies that don't eat meat. Um, maps. This teriyaki sauce, I wanted to try one of those. Broccoli, some breakfast bar, snack bar things that are low calories and look really nice. Tuna, some of these protein yogurts, so I'm really trying to up my protein if you can't tell, because um, I feel like I'm low in it. And yeah, these look really nice. My brother eats them, he says they're really nice. So a few flavors of that. I've got raspberry, vanilla, and strawberry. Pineapple, oat milk, this low calorie ice cream because I always crave something sweet after I've eaten. <laughs> and I'm going to put it with like a couple of pieces of chocolate, lettuce, tomatoes, and some toilet bowl. Hi guys, just thought I'd end this vlog here. I am just editing it now, I finished editing it and realised there was no last clip. Um, it's Tuesday and yeah, I haven't vlogged yes yesterday. I had the worst migraine ever. I couldn't even like open my eyes all day. So <laughs> I didn't vlog anything else, but I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you want to see more of me, make sure you do subscribe. I am posting every Wednesday and Sunday at the moment. I'm not gonna promise you that's gonna happen because you, you know me, I'm the worst vlogger ever. But yeah, hopefully we're gonna stick to it. Um, so new video coming on Sunday and then there'll be a new vlog next Wednesday as well. So make sure you do subscribe and then you won't miss out on those. Thanks guys and I will see you very soon. Bye!